Hello everyone, welcome back to Grimm's Garage. And today, we're looking at a $50 bill haul. This, all this, although, honestly, 90% crap, just cost me a $50 bill. Now, a local collector on our Facebook club. Um, basically, text, no photo, said, I have a bin of about 150 carded cars, all Hot Wheel, all Fantasy, 50 bucks takes a lot. I messaged him and asked him a little more detail. And he said, well, yeah, it's uh, a little less than 150 on the cards, plus about 20 loose cars, mostly fantasy, maybe one or two other things. But yeah, 50 bucks. He lived close to where my wife works. I said, I'll take a go at it if you're willing to deliver it to my wife's work location, which she did the next morning. So I ended up with a 140 carded or bagged vehicles, 99% fantasy. There are a couple of race car things that action driver actually really wanted. And about 39 loose fantasy cars, which is why I pulled out the hauler. We're going to take a look at these first, and we'll take a look at what's on the cards. So this is going to obviously be a big skip-through video for most people. What do we got here? Power pipes. Right. Ooh, not seeing a name on this one. But here we go. Seems like something I'd see on a Gotham cartoon. MX-48 Turbo. Oop. T gray. Time a taxi, I think it's called. Time a taxi. They advertise the moving part on this, which is just a bendable piece of the interior plastic. It's not that fantastic, to be honest with you. But it's still a fun looking model. Project Speeder. Yeah. A lot of track cars here. This one's kind of sharp. This is audacious. Audacious. Honestly, I kind of like that. You know, out of all these, I think I'll keep this one. That'll be a keeper. I'll put that down here for me. Ristorat. What we got here? Rapid Transit. Roller toaster.
muscle tone. Kind of liking the colors in that one. Rapid Transit. Again, I think we already looked at one of these. Hollow back. Hollow back. New one to me. Spectite? Spectite? Looks like a speeder. Overboard 454. Street Creeper. Yeah. Ultra Rage. Looks like something from Judge Dredd. No name on that guy. Familiar though, I've seen this one a few times. Oh, this thing's plastic though, I think I've got a version that's more metal. I haven't seen this before. He actually... His wheel spread's too wide. Oh, there's a copy. I've already got one of these overboard right there. What is this? MX-48 Turbo. Oh, well. Could have just read the side of the door. Fast. Feline. Split Vision. Furosity. Furosity. Pretty cool. Casualties. What else we got? Four. Four left. Torque screw. Oh, that guy's a little wide as well. Is the same? This is the same. What's this?
medieval. Hmm. A little different. And our last Lucy for today. Fast Fortress. Made it look like a World War II bomber. All right. I'm keeping this guy. Put that guy aside. Otherwise, we're gonna get these guys out of our way to look at all the card of delights for today. Pause for a moment so I can get this straightened out. All right, back after a camera adjustment, we're gonna dig down into these bagged Hot Wheel cars. Series two mystery models. I did take a quick look ahead, looked them up, and I saw that there's really nothing special that I'm concerned with. So why don't we just open all of these? And sell them as Lucy's because I really don't give a crap. What is this guy called? Oh. Chevrolater? Gotta be honest with you, I'm not liking that. Might be a track star, but I'm not liking it myself. It comes with the sticker. Next one. Just says RD 08. And matching sticker. Coolator, coolator, coolator. sticker. And the last of the bag mystery model. Okay, no doubles. I thought we'd get at least one double. This is the governor. And matching sticker. These guys. All the way back up and right over with the Lucy's. Now, as stated, this video is like I said, he said they were all fantasy vehicles. There does happen to be a handful of non fantasy included in here, which would be this guy, which is the only non Hot Wheel item in the whole lot and these two items which are still Hot Wheels they all seem to be racing items I'm not even familiar with this Hasbro 1998 Hasbro Winner's Circle Dale Earnhardt so we got that now, me, myself, personally, I'm not a racing fan at all, but even in the die-cast, just toy-having, collectible world, the racing stuff doesn't seem to do too well. I'm not 
at least in my area. Here we have Hot Wheels, commemorative edition. Matt Kenseth, DeWalt Tools, 52861, whatever that means. Take a pause on that. 2001. Accompanying it, Jeff Burton, Sitco, 52860, number 99. Alright, get the race car stuff out of the way. How well action pack. I was actually very excited to see this in the bin. I actually really like this. I This was on my hit list. I wanted all these. I have this one. Still want this. Still want this. This is my least interesting. Or I'm least interested in this one. Um, but if I come across it, I'll still take it. And here we have... The police force. We got a armored bank car with a bag of money, squad car, police officer, a burglar with his arms up. This is for me, so let's open it up and check it out. Money pile came right out. A lot of twist ties. Let's try to just cut most of this out. twisted these ties around these tires back in the day. If you're not careful, you can mess up your toys. Alright. Here's our armored vehicle. Armored car services. Don't get held up. Not seeing a name on it. It's a 98 date. Okay, that's unusual. It looks like double doors, as standard from the outside. But it opens as one giant one from the inside. And from the inside, it looks like a vault door within the bank. So, huh. A little interesting on that. Got a little money bag. Highly crude, to be honest with you. I'll just shove that in there. And the squad car. Police to protect and serve. A decent little squad car. Is it model left or anything? Uh, it doesn't say. It's got a date on there. I think it says 77. Hmm. Dodge, maybe? Not exactly sure. But, I'll be honest with you. 
I'm in these little sets mostly for the dumb little plastic accessories that you can use for anything else. Here we have our little arms up robber and police officer. All right. Let's get this wall of cars out of our way. We're already 20 minutes in the video. Everybody's skimming ahead like crazy. Let's get this stuff out of the way. All right, character car. We got Star Wars Chewbacca. It's a 2021 date. Spider-Man character car. That's pretty cool for a drag racer. 2016. All right, now, I think, you know, not all, but most of this front pile, in front of the back pile, is all treasure hunts. I mean, not great treasure hunts, obviously. They're the fantasy models, but here we go. Here's a treasure hunt skull shaker with the 2020 date. Got two of the Raging Expresses, which I already have this treasure hunt for my collection. I've got two more of those. So it's the oh, Ollie Rocket. Got two of those treasure hunts. 2020. Four tuned twin mills. And most of these recent treasure hunts I'm showing you I already have a pile of my own, so I'm only doubling the pile of garbage. Yep, yeah, 2021. Keep in mind when I say the dates, I'm saying the date that's on the card, although we know it came out most likely a year after it. These are actually 2022 models, although the card says 2021. Treasure hunt. Gotta go. Ooh. Gotta go. Got four of those. 2021. So it's 2022's Drifting Eater. Got five of those. That's it for the treasure hunt, so we're on to normal cars. Alright, and the first eight cars that we're going to go over is actually a set of Guardians of the Galaxy 2. Here's number four, Scorcher, Gamora theme. These all came from 2016. general theme on the quicksand star lord on the slingshot general theme on the rd08 Rocket Raccoon theme on the Fast Fish. Drax theme on the Riveted. Rocket Fire. 
I'd say general theme, but it seems to be themed after their ship. And the last of that series, group theme on the Solar Reflex. of this mountain. First stack. We have a tankinator. You know what? 2015. This one's for me. I'm opening it. I think I have only one other one so far. I know there's plenty to go. So I will enjoy that one from my collection. Next, we have the 2Jet Z, which I do collect. Oh, we have a casualty. But I do have this one already, so don't need that guy. Winter 2017 Fandango. Um, pretty sure I don't have this, so I'm gonna open it whether I do or not. It's mine. I do collect the Fandango Winter 2017 Primer Gray with black and gold accents and red glass. Mm. Very nice. That tank back up there, that's the guy that fell when we weren't looking. Alright. Hot Wheels High. Um, hmm. Got two here. Again, I think I need them both. So with that, I'll open them both. It's not going to hurt me. Whether it's a carded for trade or loose for trade, I got all of these for a $50 bill. Remember that. All this video was $50 bill. So even if I can't trade or resell these, I could take these 140 cards back to Walmart and they'll give me a return on that. They'll take them back. I could tri easily trip my money right there, but I'm not going to do that. Hot Wheels High, Flames Basketball Team logo. And we have another one. Hot Wheels High. Regular Hot Wheels theme. Mm. Oh. There's another Van Dango. But unfortunately, I do have this one. So that'll go back on the trade table. And the Hot Wheels Ford Trains to Connect. Uh, I do have this one, so... I'll have to pass on that as well. Otherwise, I would have opened that. What else we got? Cruiser Bruiser's a favorite of mine, but I got that one. 2015. We got Time Shifter. I like this guy, but I got it. 2015. Z-Rod. Oh, looks like a lot of fun. Seems like a... Track star, maybe some gold in the dark tires on this one, but otherwise, visually, I personally couldn't give a crap about that. Let's get these guys out of the way. Next, we 
have MR11. Whatever that is. What is that theme? 2016 Winter Olympics? Or, I don't know. It's a whole lot of blue. That's what threw me off. I just see 2016 and a whole lot of soccer or football. Soccer here in America. Apologize. American ignorance. I'll take that up later. All right. Rig heat. 2015. 2005. Dodge Tomahawk. You know, I'm opening that. That's mine. Quite the bike. And Gazella GT. Twenty fifteen. Sky Dome. Twenty seventeen. Yeah. Next we got a three pack of hot dogs. Street Wiener. Three different colors. I don't think any of them are treasure hunts. No, nope, just three different variations of the Street Wiener. Which I was intrigued by. And I like the fact that the, the back is a grill that you can kind of close. But I'm not going to open or collect this model. We got 2015, 2017, and 2017 on these. Alright. Chill Mill. Love my food and delivery vehicles, but I'm gonna pass on this guy. Way too crazy for me. 2017. Surf and Turf. Tune Surf Wagon 2015. Wheelie Chair, which um, I'm going to keep this. I only have one version of this in the purple. So, here's a silver one. Possibly go in the dark front tires. Cool. Oh, it's doing a wheelie. Renin rig. The 2017 holiday season series. Winning formula. 2015. Repo duty. Fifteen. Next layer. We have the carbonator from this color from 2017. And I believe yes, we have another carbonator, an alternate color from the same year. Solid Muscle, 2017, HW50, Twenty Seventeen. quite big wheels on that guy, oh, Classic Series Twin Mill, 2017, 
2015. Off Duty 2016. We got a special truck series. Ooh, Justice League RD09. Theme of the Flash 2017. Scuba de Fuego. 2017 holiday issue street stealth 2015 rigor mortar which I'm gonna open this I'm keeping this guy this is for me I think I only have one other one that was highly, it was a, uh, it was a better off custom deluxe model and I was very pleased with it. I had an opening dome in that. So yeah, I'm going to keep these. Rig and mortar. It's got casket, hot rod. Aisle driver. I've decided I'm going to keep, start keeping these. In fact, I started keeping a lot of the ones that can use the little plastic man that they provide. Just for the playability's sake, I want to see if that's spooky. I just want to see the difference in the playability, what you can do with these little figures on the different models. Like, uh, this is one of the other models that the plastic figures can play with or interact with. Handlebars and such. But anyway, I do have the target version of this. It came with a big hauler. And I really, really believe this model was designed after the target. Um, trolley. Because, or shopping cart here in the States. Because of the hexagonal holes. And that is a target. That's a, that's a target cart all the way. So. I really believe they designed that after the target cart. And just reused it for whatever they wanted else. Otherwise. But yeah, that looks like fun. We get some little plastic men out. Play with some other things next layer diesel duty another winter edition for 2017 what is this Hot Wheels City Works sci-fi okay, it's like a hover chopper it's something out of Judge Dredd kind of thing 2015 ice shredder Seems to be a bobsled team. Bobsled racing. 2015. Got a pair of two tufts from 2017. We got the Tour de Fast. Which is always torn with it. Obviously it looks like a wagon, but too weird for me to want. 2015. We got a pair of Hot Wheel Formula Solars. That same model. 2015. Let's get some of this up there. And we got Twin Mill. 2017 Bazunka new for 2018 this is a figure 
car 2017 but not one that I'm interested in playing with so pass moto wing so it's kind of cool it's kind of half race car half motorcycle 2017 Next layer. Got another repo duty. I think that's a different color. 2015. We've got a diaper dragger. It's supposed to be like a drag racer bassinet. 2017. CCM Country Club Muscle. 27 or 2015 rather Velocita 2015 Electrac 2017 Amazon 2015 Fast Cash, which doubles as a money clip, by the way. Sometimes they show it off, they're not showing it off here. Anyway, this is from 2015. Yes, Fast Cash is a money clip. Gazella R 2015 Another diaper dragger this time in blue 2017 What is this? Track Manga Nice hot pink 2017 on that one. Tooligan. Which actually doubles as an actual wrench. 2015. Hotweiler. Twenty fifteen. Fourth to last layer. Another holiday series from 2017. Super Blitten. Thirty-six cord. So there's some non-fantasy. Two thousand four. Hmm. Time shifter and a pizza theme, which is mine. So we're gonna go ahead and open that one up. Need this one for my collections. Now we have it. Thank you. Next, D Muscle. Twenty fifteen. Crate Racer. Which I was torn on. This is kinda like a squash custom Volkswagen truck looking thing. I don't know, but I decided not to keep this model. Twenty fifteen. Fangula. Not too bad, that's actually kind of cool. Still not for me. 2015. 2015 on this Dogzilla. Few dog themed cars in this lot. Flash drive. Hmm. Never heard of that one before. 
Rocket box. 2015. 16 Angels. Twenty fifteen. Another aisle driver. That'll be for me. This one in blue. It just says with ride downs. We got ourselves another little blue guy this time. Shark bite with moving jaw. So it's 2015 on that one. Terrain storm. 2015. Desert drifter, which honestly I've never liked. I don't like most of these dessert ones. 2021. Boom car. You know what? I'm going to open this. I'm going to check this one out. 2015 on the card. Right, it's like a circus. Human cannon. You stick one of those aisle driver guys in there. Alright. Might be a bit of fun. Sweet Driver. 2021. Track Manga again. Different theme. Twenty twenty one. Doing it up. Almost close to something I would have collected, but I'm gonna pass on this one. 2015 Dodge Charger Daytona so another non-fancy but something I'm still not into 2015 Head Starter Got ourselves a classic TV series, Batmobile, tuned, ver excuse me, tuned version, 2021. A lot of these going around nowadays. And a pedal driver, which I'm interested in checking out. Whether I decide to keep it for the long run or not, I wanted to experience this. So this is another one can interact with a little plastic guys back there. You snick, stick one of those guys in here. Looks like he's riding a little pedal car. Kind of cute. Let's get some of this out of the way. Second layer. Skull Crusher. Not a fan, but this is a uh, cool colors on this one at least to me 2015 El Viento 2015 Dear Choice series Street Beast King of the Road a lot going on there. A whole lot of a whole lot of not for me. There's a day 20, 1996. I don't like my haulers, but I don't keep this guy. The Hollinator. Way too tuned fantasy for me in 2015. 
Oh, we got ourselves another tour de fast. We went over this one already. Uh, Dragon Wagon, which I already have this one. Red one. 2021. Oh, what is this? It says power panel. It's new to me, it looks cool. I think I'm gonna keep it. Power panel. Too bad. Liking the colors on that guy. I ended up opening and keeping more than I thought I would from this pile. And again, remember, I paid 50 bucks for the whole pile. And I'm happy with my $50 purchase of what I kept. I've got 90% of it. That's going to go back on the trade table. Night Shifter. 2015. GT03 2015 Pile Driver twenty fifteen Blitz Beater. 2015. A lot of chrome around that time. Another tool again. We already went over that guy. Alright, so our last pile for the day. What have we got? Drifta. Twenty fifteen. Custom Ford Bronco, which is mine for opening there. Oh, um, from twenty fifteen, by the way. I just picked up another one of the smiles from the latest uh, truck series from Hot Wheels. So I'll get to compare that up. In fact, is that laying around here somewhere? Uh, no, not at arm's length. Thought of doing a preview. But yeah, definitely keeping this guy. Hammered Coop, 2015, Gazella GT, we may have already seen that one already too, 2015, Flyby. I almost want to open this just out of curiosity of whether the middle spins when you roll it. Like, is it geared? That would look kind of cool. But otherwise, I'm not interested in this. 2015. Obviously rotates. It moves around when you shake it. Oh. Zoom in. Got a pair of zoom ins. These both from 2017? Yes, they're both from 2017. We got a black one and a white one. Now they're made to go work with the GoPro cameras, which I don't have a GoPro. To be honest with you, I don't think I intend to ever get one. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe just for the Hot Wheels. Deadass, because um, I've seen some of the YouTube videos of people doing some really nice GoPro videos on the Hot Wheel tracks with these vehicle adapters. And they seem like a 
a lot of fun. So I'm not going to knock it. And I'm going to grab one while I can. I mean, it basically got these free in this giant pile. I might as well hang on to them. So we got a pair of GoPro car adapters. The embosser. I will open this. I've got one other one of this. Because it does 90% pass as a regular hauling truck or tow truck, but it does emboss or I forget how. I don't know why. Oh, and the other one, like, a couple weeks ago, I could have swore the top came up a little farther than that. But anyway, you can slip a piece of paper through the bottom slot here, and you can press it down, and it'll press an embossed image onto it, which I believe is just the Hot Wheel flag. Voltage spike. Actually, looks kind of cool. From 2015. Fast felon. Please like and subscribe. It helped me out tremendously, by the way. Monta Racer. From 2015. And last but not least, 2000 First Editions Pro Stock Firebird. So I guess that's not really a fancy car either. 1999. Thank you all for joining me today. Sorry about the hour video, almost literally. Please know you're all appreciated if you sat through this long. Thank you so much. Please comment below, and I hope to see you again. Thank you all so much.